Hey guys, just want to give a quick shout out for the game Critical Ops. There will be a link in the description for you to download it and check it out for yourself. It's fun. I would do it. Highly recommended. Let's get on with the video. Hey bros, how's it going? Welcome back to the Indie Dev Corner. Today I'm playing a game called Colorado? Colorado? I think? Uh... Oh, there's a dark mode. Oh, cool. Col color Colorado. Colorado? Colorado! <gasps> I don't know. Uh, what is this? No upgrades. What? Ten. A fewer obstacle type cards. What? I don't know what these upgrade things are. I played this a little bit, and I'll be honest, I'm, I'm quite enjoying it. It's nice. It's very peaceful. It's essentially... Um, what is that game called? Uh... Uh, I can never remember the names of these games when I start recording. I like, I know it ahead of time, and then I forget it. But um, two two forty eight, I think, is what it was called, or something like that, where it's a number sequence, and you're basically putting these tiles down and trying to get to a certain number. This one doesn't have a specific number that you have to get to, and you can place these tiles anywhere. And the goal is to just try to build up and see how high you can get. And you get these kind of weird, um, I think they're called obstacle cards, where they don't have a color in it, and you can't use it until you put the corresponding color in it, which makes sense. Um, the other cool thing about this is you can slide these up and down, you can move them, where was it? You can move them left and right. The only downside is, if you do, it'll randomly assign the next card to one of these, so uh, you kind of have to be careful where you're going to place these things at. So like, I have a three here, I'm going to put the three in the space so I can actually use that one. Um, and I kind of want to shift this so that I can make something worthwhile out of it there. Uh, let's see, three, we'll put a three there, a two there, and you can connect any of them as long as they're the same number and at least there's two, and as long as there's at least two. So it's nice. It's a very relaxing kind of game. It's, it's very peaceful. Uh, let's scoop this over there. Ooh. There's a lot I can use. If I drop this down here, oh man, I can use a lot there. It'll take all of them. Seven. Nice. Okay. Um, so I think you get an additional one for every card that you put on. So like, if I move these two fives together, right, then they jump up to six. But if I put that other five on here, it would go to seven. So if that makes sense. Uh, let's see. We'll put this here and turn that into six and then make seven and drag this down and then make eight. And, oops, oops, that's the wrong, darn it. Okay, if I put that there, ah, darn, I messed that up. Oh, no, I can put that like that, there we go. So now I have four. It does take, like, a little bit of thinking, but there's no real, like, consequences to this, like 248, where it's just constantly putting things down and putting things in your way. It, you really just kind of go at your own pace. It's nice, it's very relaxing. Um, like I said, there's not a whole lot of thought to this game, which is actually pretty nice. A lot of games nowadays, there's a lot of, you know, you got to really think everything through. This not so much, because you can just place whatever down and then, you know, you're not having to connect a whole bunch of them in one go to try to make something, which is nice. Um, let's see, we'll put a six there, a four there, bam, like that. Easy. And then I cleared out a whole bunch of the stuff there. And really, you just take this game as, as long as you want. You play... I played it for a little while prior to actually recording this. Just because I kind of wanted to test it out and see like what I was going to be getting into. And I gotta say, I'm really enjoying it. It's very peaceful. Very relaxing. Uh, we'll put uh, this there. Ooh. Uh, and then, like you can think, uh, uh, you can think all of this ahead if you want to. You don't necessarily need to do that. You just kind of just go, go at your own flow, kind of thing, you know. Ah, there we go. Uh, bam. Oh, where where would I put a three? I guess I could put a three there, put a five there. Oops, oops, that's the wrong one. There we go. Put that there. Put that there. Um, kind of move that down that way. 
That should give me nine also. Now I have ten. Sweet. Uh, 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 not that one. There we go. Move that there. Uh, ooh. There we go. And I like that. So, like, you don't really have to worry about getting yourself cornered or anything either. Because you can just kind of drag these around and move them wherever you need them to go. So it's very easy to be like, you know, because in like 248 and, uh, or I think that's what it was, 24, 2048, that's what it was. Um, in 2048, you really have to think everything out because once you place something down, unless you're going to be getting rid of it soon, you're kind of stuck with it there. This, I can place a, this anywhere and I really don't need to care too much um, because I can just move it out of the way like that. Let's see, we'll put that there. Uh, we'll put that there. But man, this is, it's so peaceful and so relaxing. I love it. And I like the soundtrack to it. Man, they picked a really good soundtrack for this game just because it's so peaceful and it's so relaxing. Uh, I guess I can put that there. Um, shoot, where should I put a five? I will put a five there. Man, I really, I, and I know I keep saying that, but I really do like this game. I think it's a really, really nice, nice game. It just plays really nicely. Shoot, I messed that up. Oh, well, not to worry. I'm already at seven. Uh, or at 11. Pfft, at 7. I can't even think properly while I'm playing this. Or something this peaceful, I can't even talk correct. Nice. Um... Uh, I guess I could put that there. <clears throat> I guess I could put that there. Yeah, I don't know. I like this game. I'm enjoying it. I could keep going with this for a while. It is very relaxing, very peaceful. Uh, I really like that soundtrack. This kind of strikes me as the kind of game that, like, you're up late at night and you need something to kind of put you to sleep. Not because it's boring, but because it's very peaceful. You're not thinking too much. It's just very relaxing. This is the kind of game you probably want for something like that. Now, uh... If you want to download the game and try it for yourself, there will be a link in the description below. And if you do download it, let me know in the comment section. I want to hear about it. Let me know what the highest number you made was. And no lying. I know when you're lying. Don't you dare lie to me. Uh, if you like this kind of video, go ahead and leave a like. It helps me know you guys like this kind of stuff. And if you're new to my channel, click on that chinchilla icon in the center. That will get you subscribed. If you're already a subscriber, hit that notification bell so that you get notified every time I upload a new video video to the left is a video that I handpicked for you guys because if you like this, you'll probably like that one as well. And the video to the right is a video that YouTube handpicked for you. So go ahead and click on one of those and I will see you guys in the next video.